Hi, my name is Aleem Rani, and I'm here to talk to you about Password Reset in Forefront Identity Manager 2010. I'm a program manager on the, uh, in the Identity and Security Division, and I work on Password Reset within Forefront Identity Manager 2010. I'll call it FIM from now on. Password Reset in FIM was really about enabling the end user and empowering the end user to do a task that traditionally was done by either the IT pro or someone on the help desk. So the scenario is you forgot your password, and you need to reset it, and you're at your desk or you're you know, at your computer, and you just don't remember your password or something happened to it. So what you would traditionally do is call the help desk, you'd wait on hold, you'd get a hold of somebody, they may issue you a new password or email it to your manager, and then you have to get that password and then you know, input that into the screen to log on. With FIM, what you can do is you can actually do the whole task yourself without actually talking to anybody. And so, you know, you can, you know, click the reset button, answer some questions, and then within a minute or two, you can reset your password. You don't have to call the help desk. You don't have to wait around, you know, on hold trying to get a hold of somebody and reset your password. So it's really about empowering the end user, again, you know, having that self-service interaction to reset your password. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk you through a scenario in which we've forgotten our password and we want to reset it. So I'm Samantha, and as you can see on the screen here, I'm at the Windows Logon screen. So we've got FIM Password Reset, which is integrated right into the Windows Logon experience. So you can see the Reset Password link here. So instead of calling the help desk, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click that link. Now, what's going to happen in the background is FIM is going to look up what needs to be done in order for me to reset my password. In this case, I need to authenticate and prove to FIM that I am who, in, f in fact, I say I am. So I am Samantha in this case. So it's going to ask me a series of questions. Now, this is an example of a challenge. There are other challenges that could be implemented in order to reset your password. For example, you could say, I want you to insert your smart card in order to prove who you are because you actually have the smart card with you. And then we could allow you to choose a new password. So for this demo and for the product in general, we have an out-of-the-box challenge called the question and answer challenge. So I'm going to go ahead and provide answers to these questions which I've previously registered for and it's going to, ch it's going to compare those to my you know, previous registrations and it's going to tell me whether or not I'm allowed to reset my password. So what was your dream job as a child? Well, I always like to play hockey so I'm going to go ahead and input that. What was the, na the first name of the boy or girl that you kissed? Well, it was Samantha. So I'm going to put in Sam. And in what city was your first job? Well, right here in Redmond. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in. I'm going to click Next. When I click Next, FIM's going to, like, like I said, compare those answers that I provided in the challenge phase to what we'd actually provided for registration. And we'll show you registration a little bit later on so you can see you know, what the interaction is like. So now I'm at this screen where I, it's validated me, it knows that I'm Samantha, and it's allowing me to now choose a new password. So at this point, I want to choose a new password, so I'm going to go ahead and enter my new password and re-enter that to make sure that I didn't type it incorrectly and click the reset button here at the bottom. FIM's going to go off, it's going to talk to Active Directory, it's going to do all the stuff that you know we don't really care about, we just want a new password, but it's going to go off and do that work for us and you can see here now that after a few seconds it gives me this message, you have successfully reset your password and now I can go ahead and click finish and I can go back to the logon screen and I can input my new password and I can log on to Windows. So we did that in a matter of a couple of minutes. We were able to reset our password. We didn't have to talk to anybody. And now we can continue on with our day and continue working. All right, now that we've seen password reset in action, we're going to take a look at what Samantha had to do in order to get password reset to work for her. So one of the things that you need to do in order to, to answer questions and reset your password is actually provide initial answers to those questions. So we're going to walk through the registration process now. So I'm now Samantha, and I'm logging on to my computer for the first time since FIM has been deployed. So I'm going to log on like I do normally. And what's going to happen now is FIM is going to, the client that runs on this computer is going to detect that I haven't registered for password reset. So it's going to go off and check the FIM server, and it's going to say, hey, you're Samantha, you need to register. So I get this welcome screen, you can see. And this is telling me that I'm going to need to provide answers to a series of challenges in order to register for password reset. So I'm going to go ahead and click Next, and FIM's going to go ahead and look up what needs to be done. Well, the first thing that comes up is the password challenge. 
This comes up because we don't want a user to be able to walk up to someone's computer and if they haven't locked their computer, register for them. So in order to actually believe that it's Samantha at this workstation, we're going to ask her for her password before she can do registration. So let's go ahead and type in Samantha's password and we'll click next. And now it's going to go off and look up the questions. So in this case, we have you know, a question and answer challenge. And the, the questions that you saw during reset were actually presented those for registration so that we can provide those initial answers and we have something to compare to when you actually want to do password reset. So let's go ahead and answer these. What was your dream job as a child? Well, I loved playing hockey, so I always wanted to be a hockey player. So we'll put in, we'll put in hockey. And what was the first name of the boy or girl that you kissed? Well, I, actually, ironically enough, it was Samantha, so we'll put in Sam. And in what city was your first job? Well, I worked in Redmond, so let's enter that. And we'll click Next, and it's going to go off and write those answers to the FIM server. Now I've actually successfully registered for Password Reset, and I'm eligible to use Password Reset in the future. And when I provide answers to the challenges, it'll compare those answers to what I just registered for. And that's Password Reset in a nutshell.